So as you can see, I'm standing in the snow. We are in the middle of Utah and Park City and we are like surrounded by mountains almost everywhere you look. We're here at Sundance Windrider to really experience the filmmaking community holistically. So we're watching films all week long and they engaged in a daily summit that lasts from nine to noon. And that's just like an opportunity where they bring in crazy cool connected filmmakers and we just get to hear from them. So the Windrider Summit has been attending the Sundance Film Festival for 20 years now and it's really a gathering of undergrad film students, seminarians, ministry leaders, industry professionals attending Sundance Film Festival and doing that through a faithful lens. Um, the Windrider Summit provides a space for young filmmakers um, and ministry leaders to talk about how God is working in film and working in culture. and. It's a really fun opportunity for specifically film students because we get direct access to Sundance filmmakers um, as well as Windrider award winning filmmakers. Everyone looks like a filmmaker, they talk like a filmmaker, everyone is so friendly and I don't think that's an understatement like I actually haven't met anyone that wasn't down to have a conversation talk about filmmaking and most of them will say hey what are you up to what kind of projects are you doing and so that's like your networking key to like get into uh, the industry uh, yeah so last night they had a 20 year anniversary for Napoleon Dynamite and we got to go there there's a lot of cast there and I got to meet the screenwriter she said that a lot of the stuff that she wrote was just taken from their life and she said that it took about six months to write the script, but it was really fun talking to her. She seemed really interested and engaged, and she was happy that I was a girl in film. Seeing all these faith-based filmmakers, I guess, shows that the film industry is not so worldly as you think it is. There still are people out there trying to make films for the Christian audience. A lot of films here have been very socially challenging, and they do challenge a lot of, I guess, topics that are not easily talked about. Getting to plug into culture and seeing culture firsthand before it hits the wider market helps me and helps all of these students be equipped to have conversations that are happening or that need to be happening. Being able to film that, like Sundance, people here have filmed that and be able to share light on that story and it does give you a little peek into that world that you may never have been able to see in your daily life. So that has been really inspirational to me. Um, well, being here at Sundance with like all of these amazing creators and young people who have put so much into the films that they've made and they've done it largely on their own without a whole lot of funding, it's super inspiring for me and um, it's given me a lot of ideas and a lot of uh, motivation to start working on my own projects. Just this morning, someone texted me and said, hey, how's Sundance going? And I thought for a second, I just said, perfect. That's the only word to describe it. This is the opportunity of a lifetime and you have to come. Like if there's any chance, if it's within your means, you have to come. If you're at all interested in filmmaking, you have to come because this is your chance not only to be inspired by literally the world's greatest films being produced right now, but also the networking opportunities are unbelievable. I mean, you're sitting on buses next to Hollywood stars, you're sitting on buses next to independent film producers, like the entire mix is here and this is this is your chance to get into the industry.